Hello everybody, my name is Wise Cream and welcome to the interview. And to be honest, I really wasn't expecting a nice little jazz intro. Oh, nice. This must be a great company. This company has worked zero days without an accent, accident. And the best previous record was zero days. Ah, success. Plastered along every wall of this company. Um, in fact, the the sign of success is... In, uh, I, I was going to talk about how cool this company is, but what? Join Q? Whoa, jeez. <laughs> okay, I don't know why. This is, that whole little bit right there just reminded me of like the Stanley Parable or something. Mindset is nothing. What? That's lame. Your dreams will never overcome your fears. Whatever you are, be a bad one. <laughs> Better days will never come. Excuse me? Do your job without passion or not at all. <laughs> In the end, you can only blame yourself. <laughs> never try, never fail. <laughs> Yo. um, oh, The cameras are on me, man. You are one day further <laughs> from your goal. <laughs> What the frick? What is it? Uh, I was gonna say, where's that music coming from? But now we're going spelunking underneath the company? Wow. I wonder what kind of interview we're about to get into. Oh, hopefully it's, it's, a, it's a nice one. I've only had to do a few interviews in my time, but all of them were high stakes. It was crazy. Um, I don't really like interviews, but frick, that's kind of freaking me out. Always be closing. What what does that mean? Always be closing. Oh, losing. Well, how, why the frick did I see lose closing? Oh no, there is a C there. Always always be always be losing. Wow. This this music does not make me feel happy. It makes me feel sad now. Oh, is this my interviewer? Hello. Hey, good good. Oh frick. Um, what is proper interview procedure before? Uh, good morning. This is registration. What do you want? Uh, I guess I'm here to register. To register, we will ask you a series of multiple choice questions. How many questions are there? We'll ask the questions. Just so you know, there are wrong answers. Okay. Should your registration be unsuccessful, you will be removed immediately. What do you mean by removed? It's a verb. It means we'll drag you out with the trash. Okay. Hey, I don't think I really want to work with this company right now then. You know, I haven't worked for a company before, but like, I don't know how companies work, corporate positions, never, never, I don't know how they work, but you know, I don't, I'm not really digging this right now. Question, question one, do you understand the conditions of the registration? Yes. Question two, do you agree to hold the organization harmless in the event of injury or death? Y yeah, I'm, I'm not sure how these, these work, because I'm not, I don't think that's entirely, you know, true how that works. How do you spend your free time? Thinking about work? Talking to other people about about work? Or working? Um, thinking about work and working, that's like, that's like different things, right? Like for example, I, I make YouTube videos on the internet, right? And I, I do them every day, and I have been for a while. And I think about it a lot, you know? I think about it, but it's not like I'm working, you know? I, I like doing it. So is it really thinking about work? Well, it's not really my job yet. So like, is it? Does it really count? You know? Okay, let's just say thinking about work, because uh, work yeah, that's a little much. Talking to other people work. Uh, well, if your job is cool, right? If you got a cool job, maybe you'll talk to people a lot. Maybe you have lots of connections in your job. You know, this is, this is always a bad thing. But if you got some boring corporate job, I mean, I guess that's kind of weird. Okay, let's just say I'm thinking about work. Okay, I, I drug that out for too long. I'm sorry. What is the color of success? Green, red, or black? Green? I guess I guess if this is the company, it's a black company. That's what I'm assuming. So black, it's black. How will you respond when your superior asks you to redo a task you spent hours on? I will gladly redo my work. I will happily redo my work. I will redo my work with abundant exuberance. That's it. That's a big one. Big words. 
Abundant exuberance. Yeah, that's a thing that normal people say, right? Abundant exuberance. <laughs> Let's do that one. Question six. What is your work style? This is this is like an RPG game right now. With like, <laughs> what is your work style? Working long hours with little rest. Working long hours with little rest and low pay. Working long hours with no rest and no pay. Okay, isn't this just slavery? <laughs> this is like not technically slavery, I guess. And let's let's just say I work long hours with little rest, okay? I don't know, maybe I'm getting that bread, or maybe I love my job, you know, maybe. If you could invent anything, what would it be? A third arm. A pill that eliminates the need to sleep and eat. That'd be awesome. Office chairs with toilets for seats. A pill that eliminates the need to eat, sleep and eat. You know how many freaking Nobel Prizes you're going to win if you do that? Do you know how, like, far you'll push humanity if you do that? Let's do that one processing answers oh boy i hope i got it surprisingly no errors detected you may proceed thanks registration i bet you love your job yeah i'm watching you too don't you know that oh hi you're there too it's kind of interesting i bet there is some sort of symbolism with uh navigating underneath a company <laughs> with, with tunnels I think that is pretty cool. This game is pretty cool so far. It reminds me a lot of something like the Stanley Parable or something like that, which I think is awesome. I think that's great. This is this is really this is really a cut above this game. It, it's it's pretty good so far. I, I'm engaged right now. I I'm totally engaging with this with this game right now, and that's that's a good thing. Okay, here we go. Uh, is this my office? A baseball bat. Um, did someone leave their stuff here? Uh, it seems like I, I can just walk over it. Can I interact with it somehow? Why is there a baseball bat there? Huh. Well, it looks like it's a dead end. I'm, I'm, I'm just going to go back then. Can't interact with any of this. Okay. Um, hey, registration guy, I got a question. There's like a dead end with like a baseball bat and like a printer. Or is that a copy machine? Isn't a copy machine also a printer? Wouldn't a copy machine also be a a, pr a printer? Because a copy machine copies things. But no, a copy machine. Well, they always come combined together. You know, there's always there's always two of them. There's always a, a printer. No, if there's a copy machine, there's a printer. But if there's a printer, that might not always mean it's a copy machine. Um. Oh, I go. Oh. Hey, are you uh, a different person? Time to test your problem-solving skills. Okay. We discovered the interns changed all the door codes around the office. Well, what did you do when you found out? We terminated them permanently. Okay. Except Eric. We can't find him. Eric? He is quite difficult to manage. What do you mean? He can't keep his hands to himself. Oh. Anyway, we reset all the door codes, except the one in this room. What do you want me to do? See if you can figure that out. It will show us if you're company material. Okay. Do you accept this challenge? Uh, sure. Here we go. Good luck, chump. Oh, what? We have to navigate all these cubicles? It's like a little maze thing. You know, I feel like working for a company, a company would like, you know, you also get to choose that company. But it's like, oh, I'm looking for something, okay. When you work for a, a place, right, um, oh, what was I want to say? We, we live in a world where it's like, it's always like, 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 pick me, pick me, you know, pick me, I want you to pick me. Because well, it, it's always like that everywhere you go, and that kind of sucks, honestly. Because like, when you're thinking about it, let's say I'm, I'm like a kid who wants to join a sports team or something. Like, you want to join the freaking NFL. You got to have someone to pick you, pick you, and then that's only when your dreams are fulfilled, you know? Someone has to pick you, and that's kind of weird, right? And sometimes it, it all comes down to luck sometimes, you know? Sometimes we want that job. We want that thing, and someone has to pick you in order to get that job. But sometimes it doesn't always go the way you want. Uh, maybe I have to try and think outside the box. I'm not seeing anything. I'm not seeing any numbers. 
Maybe there's like uh, uh, What if these cubicles are in the shape of numbers? No, that's too much. What if it's counting how many lamps there are? One, one, two, yeah, these random lamps on the floor. Maybe that could be something. No. Oh, found a number. That's a two. What, what the? F Hey, what's up, cardboard cutout? What are you, Eric? Are you Eric the cardboard cutout? What do you, what do you do? How do you keep your hands to yourself? You don't got any hands, you paper frick. Oh, that's freak. <laughs> that's freaky. That's that's silly. That's that's funny. That's weird. That's that's okay. All right, whatever. I know there's a uh, a thing on the other side of the on the other side of the place. I can see Eric. I can see Eric <laughs> overneath. Over, overneath. Did I actually just say overneath? The guy, I'm inventing words out here. I see his head above the freaking cubicle wall. So let's investigate this next thing. Oh, is he gone? Oh no, he's just hard to spot. Is he still? <laughs> okay, we got a seven, two seven. Hey, you frick, you paper frick. What do you mean? Have what? Cardboard, huh? Huh? Eric? Eric with a K? You spell your name with a K at the end? Is that because your parents wanted you to be special, Eric? I'm so sorry if your name is Eric and it ends with a K, man. Like, I'm, I did not mean to insult you, and I'm sorry. But why, why does your name end with a K, you know? Like, I, d I don't know why. I forgot what number that was. God damn, you frick. I'm not even, I'm not, I'm not even like, look, I already got that number, okay? It's a two and a seven. Damn. Wait, that's, this is a different one. Yeah. Hey, Eric, you, you missed one. Wait, so that mean there's multiple twos? That was a two, two. Look, look at this one. Yeah, these both got twos in them. Eric, what's the, what's the password? Are you just like shadowing me right now? Is this your first day in the job? Because technically I haven't even started my job yet. I'm like, I'm not even not even out here so two two seven okay we got we got three numbers let's just guess the last one man I'm not freaking doing this nope okay I actually need to find it wow that kind of sucks here it is the last one man zero Eric it's zero wait what so it's Two two seven zero, or in those combinations. Hey, I did every conversation com combination of two two sevens and zeros. I I don't think oh, maybe the game like stopped me until I found all of them. So let's try two two seven zero. Two seven two zero. Seven two two zero. Zero seven two two. Oh, frick. Two seven two zero. Frick. Two two seven zero seven zero two seven seven two frick man come on zero two two seven zero I think being a little bit more clear Eric on on where's Eric 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 freaking oh, whatever he's bailing on me already oh man can you believe this guy I mean where is human resources I have a problem to report, man. Well, I don't know how human resources work again. I don't know how companies work. That was a really, really sad performance. Yeah, that wasn't that wasn't too great. Yeah. It was harder than I thought it would be. It was so sad that if I cared, I'd be out of tears. Okay. I'm surprised you're not still in there. Okay, I get your point. The thing is, we no longer have interns. Interns? What does that have to do with me? We've decided to offer you a job. Really? I'm as surprised as you. Can you tell me more about this job? It is quite the opportunity. You'll definitely be challenged. What do you mean by challenged? It's a verb. It means we'll test your abilities. Shouldn't take too long. Okay. Do you accept this job offer? Sure. Welcome to the team, Rube. Orientation is this way. It's gonna be a, it's gonna be a death death zone. You know, I'm gonna walk into this place. There's gonna be a freaking shotgun affixed to the edge of this door frame, and I'm gonna. Okay. I'm about to get I'm about to get murderized. That door is about to close. I'm going to suffocate in this in this dark tunnel. My body will never be found. 
I will never see the light of day again. This is my resting place. This is my last stop. This is it. I'm done. Terminated. You know? They're going to do that freaking goofy goofy villain layer thing where the, the floor just opens up and I fall into a trap door and I die. In fact, I'm going to start running towards my death. I don't fear it. Oh. Oh, no, look. It's freedom. <laughs> it's, the op it's the outdoors. It's the wilderness. <laughs> it's nature. This is where they've left me. Honestly, I'm okay with this. This is nice. Okay. So, I guess I'll just walk home. Catch the bus. You know, maybe... This, I'm gonna say something. This is, like... Just the atmosphere of this whole whole game is, like, a lot... It's, it's really good for an indie game. It's really good. I really appreciate it. What is this? Orientation. Is orientation just going to be like a firing squad and I'm going to walk in and it's going to... Hello? What the frick? What is this? What the frick is this, man? Can we can we start up that jazz music again? That was nice. Hey, what's going What's What is this? What the hell is this? We're just in the mil middle of the freaking wilderness and it's just random walls constructed out of nowhere. Oh, this does remind me of a... A thing I did with the Marines. Ah, oh, I'm not going to tell that story right now. What is going on? What? It's not a maze. It's just a... Who the frick put this here? You know how hard it is to build something like this in the middle of the freaking wilderness? Oh. Oh, what? What? <laughs> Do you frick! It's the, it's the robot overlords! Ah! <laughs> ah, what a what an amazing representation. With the with the upcoming AI revolution, it seems like that it will never be able to approach humanity until humanity steps into it willingly and it kills me. All right. <laughs> Try again. Wait, what? No way. Does this mean that the indomitable human spirit can continue? The indomitable human spirit. <laughs> what? The indomitable human spirit surpasses all, including the AI technologies that we've created. It's over for you. I will do it for humanity. For humanity, yes. Yes, for the humanity. <laughs> Report back tomorrow at 8. Oh. Thanks for playing. Did I pass my test? Well, everybody, that was the interview. That was a very cool little game. And may I say, I am very impressed with the atmosphere, Mr. Geoff. That was that was pretty cool. Uh, however, the, the bit with, like, the searching for the numbers could have been a little bit, you know, more of a... Uh, how do I say this? Assisted? Uh, it was just... It was just walking in circles for me. That, that, that could have been fixed. But other than that, it was really cool. I really liked it. Thank you, everybody, so much for watching. If you liked the video, please... Consider subscribing because it'll help out a lot. And hopefully I'll see you around. Bye-bye.